Hello everyone, my name is Somonger and I'd like to welcome you guys back to The Legend of Zelda Link Between Worlds. And as you can see, I was doing a little off-screen work. I got 3,695 rupees now after gambling big time in La Rule. It has paid off. I wanted to do that so that I could buy all the items from Ravio this episode. So let's go ahead and start there at our house, not Ravio's house. And see what he's got to say. A warm welcome to you, Mr. Hero. Alright, Ravio, I'm here to put you out of business. Let's buy everything. This is the ice rod. Yes, I want to purchase it. For 1,200? Of course. I have plenty of cash flow. I'm gonna go ahead and buy that. So now we have the ice rod. We can also upgrade that at Mother Mai Mai's. Oh, you're welcome, Ravio. You're welcome. Let's go ahead and buy the sand rod. This is only 800? Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yes, I am going to buy it. Real nice. And we have purchased the sand rod. Booyah. And for our last purchase, the tornado rod. Oh, yes. Ravio, you are now out of business and you can leave my house with your silly little bird. Actually, you know what? I'll keep the bird as payment for rent. I like that. I like Shiru. He's a nice guy. Nice little birdie. My deepest thanks for being the best customer ever. And now he has a different voice. Oh, yes. You're welcome, Ravio. At last, I've sold all my items. Yay for me. Thanks to your efforts, Mr. Hero. I've made a great pro. I mean, I've made a great friend. And there's just one more thing. I'm closing down my shop. I mean, I sold you everything. So I can finally retire and live the good life. Whoop whoop booby boop whoop boop 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 dooby doop doop doop. Sorry, I just had to get that out of my system. I think I'm going to kick my feet up for a bit while I figure out what I'm going to do next. Yeah, bow to me, Ravio. Bow to me. Anyway, I just gotta bow down to you, Mr. Hero. I can't believe that you found so many rupees for me. Now, best of luck out there. Me and old Shiru here will keep rooting for you. Thanks, Ravio, and thank you, Shiru. Like you the best. Okay, so he's just getting sentimental on us. Let's walk out of here, and then let's walk back in and see if he's gone already. Rabio, you better be gone. I want my house back. Oh, he's just taking a nap. Okay. Welcome back, Mr. Hero. He's just gonna be chilling here forever. What a freeloader, I tell ya. Alright, we got more important things to do. Let's go ahead, get these things upgraded right away off the bat. We can only upgrade, I believe, two of them? I can't remember offhand. We're gonna find out right now. So, in to visit Mother Mai Mai. I knew you'd be able to help me. Thank you. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. There's some more babies. Oh, I can make something of yours nicer. Please give it to Mother Mai Mai. Let's go ahead and upgrade that ice rod. Yes. This will cool you off, Mother Mai Mai. Suck it in. Yes. That'll give you a brain freeze. And it comes out. Even more spiky looking. Nice! The ice rod is more powerful now. Try it out to see its stronger effects. Booyah! And we have the ice rod. I can make something of yours now. Yes, I know you can. Let's go ahead and make... This is the only two things left. Sand rod. Why not? Well, no. Let's go Let's go tornado rod. I have a feeling we're going to need the tornado not rod once again. Maybe. I don't know. I could be wrong. Suck that in. And I think we need more Mai Mai's to upgrade the last item. Wow. That thing looks like a real stick now. Nice. So we have upgraded the tornado rod as well. My babies are so shy. You might not even see them when you walk by. You can hear them cry. So please find out where they all hide. And that is all we can upgrade for now. Let's go and check out our new items. I'm excited about this. We got the ice rod here, and the nice tornado rod. All powered up tornadoes to... Oh, okay, uh, I read that wrong. Sorry about that. Use a powered up tornado to snare your enemies in one foul swoop. And the ice rod 
Freezes lots of things in wide areas with four icicles. All right. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Now, instead of one, that's four. Nice. Okay, let's try out the tornado rod. All right. Looks pretty much the same. I like the new ice rod. I dig it. I dig it a lot. All right. So, we got some walking to do. We got some freezing of peeps to do. Oh, wow. I took a hit. Of course. You go ahead and use the new items, and you get pulverized for it. So, we got a couple things to do. I would like to upgrade the Master Sword to level 3 this episode. So, I have read a little bit on where to get the Master Sword upgraded or how to get the last piece of Master Ore, but I don't exactly know it step by step. I just know where the location of it is. So, we are going to be going to the Sanctuary to find the last piece of Master Ore. I'm excited about this. Then we will be all powerful, and the last thing we need to do is find the rest of the Mai Mai's. There's Dampy. He's just hanging out. What are you doing, Dampy? He's like, oh, oh. Okay. We'll see you later, Dampy. And I'm excited. Wow, really? That guy came out of nowhere. I'm excited to get... Like I was just saying, do I not have this? Do I have that on the map? I could have just flew here. Do I have this? No, I have this. Okay. I'm excited to get the final thing upgraded, which is the sand rod as well. So let's see what's happening in here. What do you want, priest? What did you say? You saw my series, hallelujah. I see then my daughter lives, and I have faith I will see her again. Amen. I can only imagine how you came to find her. You have my deepest thanks, Link. Hallelujah. What's this? This is the painting of the captain that Yuga left on the wall. Okay. That's pretty funny. And here we have a merge hole. So let's go on through to the other side. Yeah. Oh, yes. Real nice. Let's put on bombs and a lantern. See a bomb hole over here. No, I'm just not seeing stuff. Philosopher. Ah, light. How long has it been since I knew such a comfort? Three years or an eternity. The world outside has been long darkened with the menace of the mast. Ah, what is a little light against the rising dark? No one honors the gods anymore. So beware, child. The end is at hand. Wow, this guy should be in New York City on the outside with one of those big billboard things that you wrap around your body saying the end is near. Let's put out his light and see what he says. Nobody bothers him. Okay. He's saying the same stuff. Wow, I'm just jumping off. I guess the end is near. <laughs> Alright, sorry about that, bro. I'm going to light this place up for you again. Alright, so here we are. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. There's our master ore right away off the bat. How do we get over to that? Hmm. Should we go this way? Okay, it doesn't look like it. I'm guessing it's not going to be that easy. So let's go ahead and see if we can figure this out. Oh, here we have a message from Hilda. Hey. Hey. Welcome back to La Rue Kingdom, Link. Where you stand now was once a holy place. Now it could not be further away from such a thing. However, nearby sleeps something that will help you on your journey. A thorough search will behoove you. So say I, Hilda of La Rue. Thanks, Hilda, babe. Always nice hearing from you. Just tapping into my mind whenever you feel like it. Crazy lady. All right. Oh, Dampy's in the house. What's up, Dampy? Can it be? You can see a Dampy? Not a soul has spoken to Dabby for so long. Dabby's old bones are near to falling apart. It's been so long. Dabby used to be the grave digger here, but now there aren't any graves to keep. Was there something the graves were protecting? Dabby can't even remember. Oh, Dampy. You little rascal, you. You little rascal. Right, let's lift this up. Throw that. Oh. It took a hit. Let's awaken this metal bird. Thank you for the weather vane at the graveyard. We do not need to save. We are on a mission. We're throwing spears at me. Ooh, what's what we got here? Oh, what do we got here? This looks a little fishy. Let's go on in. All right, lots of skulls. Ooh. Ah! 
Of course. Of course. Why would it be anymore? Oh, we got a button. Hmm. Where are we going to be taken with this? Hopefully, this will lead us... Ooh, there's a key. This is exactly how we started the game, but now we're in our... In La Rule here. And there's a key up top. Another treasure. More rupees. Thank you. Snakes with the skull. Wow, these flying eye bats are like a really big pain in the butt. That's why I destroy them. Where are we going? Definitely need that key. I'm gonna go over here and do this again. It's like deja vu here. Wish I had a little bit more life. It'd be a little bit easier. But no one ever said it was gonna be easy. Grab our 20 rupees. Merge on over. There's our key. Booyah! So, is this like a mini dungeon? It almost seems like it. Let's use our boots. We haven't used these for a while. Let's run on over here. Good use of them. Booyah. Let's open up our way. Hopefully this will take us to the master ore. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Wake up. Wakey wakey. Wakey wakey guys. Oh yeah. Booyah. Real nice. That wasn't too bad. Those guys are usually pretty good. They have no regard for their life. They do not care. Was it the left one or the right? I don't remember now. Okay, it was definitely the right one. Hopefully these guys can give me some hearts though. There's a heart. Perfect. Tried burning one. Didn't work out too well. Okay. Snakes! Jeez. Snakes with skull heads. The worst snakes. Alright, this should open the door. Booyah. Real nice. Real nice. Go on up. Nice. Oh yes. Oh yes, we have made it. Booyah. You got some master ore. The blacksmith can now use it to improve the master sword. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Real nice. Real, 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 real nice. Oh yeah. I'm excited. I bet you guys couldn't tell. And here's a Mai Mai. Let's go ahead and grab the Mai Mai. Why not? Booyah. Now I did want to see what was up this ladder real quick and it looks like just a merge hole so we're gonna go ahead and open this up just so we have it I have a feeling we are going to need it pretty soon here as our last dungeon is in the top right corner and we might as well grab the Mai Mai there we go perfect so we got two Mai Mai's out of that real nice Ah, oh, but I didn't go in there. Okay, that's okay. We can just walk in here and go back in there real quick like. So let's go ahead and do that. See what's in that cave. And then we will go and get our Master Sword upgraded to level 3. The strongest of the strong. And here you thought the Master Sword was already the strongest of the strong. You were wrong. It's going to be even more mighty. We're going to be able to kill people just by looking at them. Just by showing them the sword. It's going to be amazing. Nothing's under there. Whoa, is that a golden bee? Is that a, is that a golden bee? I don't think that's a golden bee. Let's, let's net it. Now, the golden bees, I've heard it's a 1 in 100 chance to find it. Some of you guys have told me that you found it in Skull Woods. So, I will check there. But, I still think it goes by chance. I'm not exactly positive on how that works. Let's go ahead and go in here and see what happens. Oh, nice! We got a piece of heart! Booyah! And that will give us another heart container. Awesome. Real nice. That was definitely worth it. Alright, so now it is time to upgrade our Master Sword. Let's go back to La Rue. And let's go to the Blacksmiths. We should be able to just bell over there with the help of Irene. Yes. Come on, Irene. Let's go, girl. Or Irene's broom. There we go. Real nice. Pretty much our broom now. I mean, Irene's not even here. And let's go on in. I'm excited about this. I'm excited about this. Can you do it for me? Here I am. I finally found some motivation. And we don't get any of that master ore. Without that, 
I can't power up your sword. No s Huh? Whoa. Whoa. Look at what you've got. Just look at it. With that master or I can strengthen your sword. How about it? Yes, please! Don't have to ask me twice. Alright, come now. Let's get to tampering this guy's sword. Give me a hand. Okay, let's do it. My arms are itching to start smithing. Okay, I talk a good game. But now it's time for me to back it up. Mmm. There we have her. The Master Sword is now at maximum strength. This is a true hero's weapon. Nice and golden, too. What do you think? Told you I was number one. This here is the mightiest sword there is. You're gonna be unstoppable now, kid. Yeah, look at it. It's a fine piece of work. A fine piece of work indeed. <laughs> nice work, fellas. Nice work. Nice work. Real nice. Let's go show it off here outside. Here it is. Full power. Why is that bird squawking? Stop squawking, bird. And here we have the charge. Real nice. Let's go ahead and look at it. And the gear. Master Sword Level 3. The Master Sword made ultimate! Now it's the fiercest blade imaginable! Imagine that. Ho ho ho! Nice. Alright, one last thing I want to do. Before we end the episode, I want to go donate some money, since I have a lot. To the Great Rupee Fairy. I don't have a ton ton, but I do have 998. So that's quite a bit. So let's throw in some donations. 200? There you go, babe. Yes. Fills your heart and your tum tum. I don't know why you would eat rupees, but you do. What you do in your free time is your own business, not mine. So we're gonna spend all our money right here on her. I wonder if we can just stand here and do this. I think we might be able to. Let's go ahead and throw 200 in here again. Mm-hmm. Yes, it does. I know. I know. I know. I'm very kind, gentle, and a brave soul. Yes, I am. Alright, yeah, we can just stay in here. Nice. Okay, throw 200 more. I don't know exactly how much money we have given her this far, but we gave her quite a bit. Alright, another throw. And we are two rupees short of throwing more in. So let's go slay a beast, slay a bad guy, kill someone outside for their money. Since we're such a kind, gentle soul. Oh wait, we don't even have to. Perfect. I'm digging this new Master Sword. It's gonna be awesome. Alright. I wonder if I need money for something. I might need money for something. Well, ah, uh, do I need money for something? I wonder. I better keep 200. I'm, I'm gonna. Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna keep the money. I'm gonna keep the money right now. I'm gonna keep the money just for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up, leave a favorite, share it with a friend, and subscribe for more. So I will see you guys all next time when we venture to the top right corner for our final dungeon. It's gonna be epic. Hey guys, thanks for watching, and if you want more Zelda, check out these awesome videos. But adventure awaits, and the kingdom isn't gonna save itself. And the princess isn't gonna kiss herself either. Well, maybe. But I want that to be my job. Hey, I'm the hero of the story, so I gotta get going. Remember, you can always follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and subscribe to me on YouTube to keep up to date with all the videos.